welcome everyone to our class today in our class we are going to continue the chapter the united nations okay so let's start today we are going to discuss about the organs of un okay uh, we already discuss about the un uh, what is un un how it is formed now today we are going to discuss about its organ you know here have when a united nations have six main organ what are they like the general assembly like the general assembly and uh, the security council the secretariat the, the economic and the social council and the international court of justice and the uh, trust ship councils okay these are the six organ so first of all we are going to discuss about the general assembly general assembly means the general assembly is the main organ of the un and most of the decisions was made here okay and it is um, uh, you know they like the parliament uh, which uh, comprise or uh, comprise all the member of the un and every member uh, member nations has at least one representative in it and the general assembly um, uh, meeting happened every year uh, one time okay one meeting happen in every year and every um, member nations has right to vote in general assembly okay and uh, all the decisions was made by this vote okay next one at the security council and uh, the main functions of the security council is to maintain the peace in all over the world basically the member countries okay and the security council consists mainly 15 member out of the five are the permanent member and others are the non permanent member the permanent members are like the usa uk china france and russia and the 10 temporary uh, members are also there uh, and they are elected a term two years by the general assembly the permanent members have veto power okay veto power it means that if any of the permanent uh, uh, members does not agree with the decisions that are um, uh, that are the members the de uh, decisions will not be uh, passed okay if veto power means if any permanent member are not agree with that decisions that that decisions uh, will not pass in the un assembly okay this is the veto power and this power only have the permanent countries okay permanent member like usa uk china france and russia okay next one is the the uh, secretariat you know the day to day working and the united nations uh, mainly carried all the uh, out of the secretariat and the facilities that are provided informations to the other un organs to their meeting all of this carried when all the other organ whatever the work is happened these are the when um, uh, basically all organized by this Uh, secretariat and the secretariat general is the head of the uh, the secretary general is the uh, head of this uh, organ okay and the secretary generals also act the spoke uh, spokespersons uh, and the leader of the un okay next one the economic and the social council okay the economic and social council promote international economic and the social uh, development and it also consists 54 member um, and uh, these are the elected by the general assembly uh, for the um, three year term okay and the member meet twice a year in april and in july and discuss the international social economic health issue and they also um, discuss about the politicals and the recommendations for the member nations okay next one is the international court of justice this is the another organ of the un that is not situated in the main center or the main headquarter of the new york the headquarter of this uh, organ is situated in the hague okay in the uh, netherland and the main judicial organ of the un and it uh, judge the uh, mainly the dispute between the various member countries and it's also comprise uh, 15 judges who are mainly consist of the 15 judges who elected for the term of the 9 years by the general assembly 
and the security council okay nine years the judge earned mainly for the nine years next on the trusteeship uh, council the trusteeship councils form the help to the self uh, slave countries for achieve the independence okay there were the 11 countries that were not independent when this council was formed but in 1994 the last of those country like palau become the independent and also become the member of un so it was um, dissolved this organ was dissolved in 1994 so this is all about the organs of the un okay i think all of you understood in our next class we will discuss about the agencies of un okay thank you everyone